venu this side in this video i am explaining one more interview tips what is that that example you have this data set employee data department id salary what is the requirement here employee id one here what is department 10 10 in this two department who is the highest salary holder this is highest salary department 20 who is the highest salary holder this is department 30 who is the highest salary holder this one so in this department i want to get highest salary in this scenario simply simply you are using group by that means um okay df dot creator replace compute top okay spark dot s select and dpt id comma count star okay What is this? Hmm. Simply, I am running SQL queries like this. Okay, I think everyone found that this is this SQL queries. What is this? Department 30, two members. This is two members. This is two members. Now, what is my requirement? Who is the highest second salary holder? Okay, at the time what happened? Max, at the time what happened? Oh, sorry. Max, sad. So, who is the max salary holder? In this scenario, you are using in each department who is the highest secondary salary. Now, department ID 30. If you want, please check. So, in this department ID, who is the highest salary holder? This one. If you want, please check department 30. This is highest salary. Department 20, 2007. This is department 10. This is 2001 is the highest salary holder. So this is. But what is my requirement? Now, my requirement as of now you are getting like this but my requirement i want to get output like this what is this employee id that means along with that i want to get i what which employee id who the employee id holder information also i want to get like this it means scenario there are <coughs> There are multiple ways. Okay, but I'm explaining one or two ways. Then you get one idea. You, okay, who is the max highest salary holder? Okay, in this scenario, this is my expectation. Along with the department, I want to get there is employee ID as well. At the time, simply, um, there are multiple ways. Okay using data frame api okay what are you doing in this scenario you are using rank functions 
crank, there is a first uh, uh, analytical functions available. You can use that. Otherwise, first of all, SQL friendly. Let's come. Let me explain SQL friendly. Okay, now why three came into picture? Uh, this is cut. Now what happened? This is max sized salary. My recommendation, if you, um, the main reason most of the members consider as, if you mention, okay, EMP ID, at the time you will get error. Why? If you want to do it EMP ID, here also you must use. Group by DEP ID, EMP ID. Then only you will get. Okay, then only you will get. Simply, if you are using EMP ID, mostly you will get this type of error. But if you are getting like this, based on business requirement, you are not getting like this. In this scenario, okay, two options. One, create temporary table means means with the temporary table as okay this is five minutes back i said you know if you are using employee id same there is no any difference you are not getting expected out in this scenario what are you doing in this scenario select t1 as T1 as execute this query. Okay. Execute this SQL query. Hmm. Next, what happened? Please note here two types of tables we have. One T2 table. I recommend instead of tab here, use T1. Simple way, it is easy, you know, T1. Okay now what is my requirement right now join these two tables now oh. select t1 table 1 dept id okay uh, t1 t1 dept id t2 max cell from T1 join T2 on T1 dot DEPT ID is equal T2 dot DEPT ID. That's it. At the time, what happened? Now, based on this condition, okay, where I want, first of all, let me check this results. First of all, let me check what are the results we get. The mean reason this is one temporary table. In that temporary table, you are getting max salary. Okay. Then earlier you have one more existing long table. In that table, you are getting these two. Okay. Based on these conditions. At the time, what happened? We will get, but not exactly expected results. What happened? Here you will get department ID. Max cell, but here you got it in wrong way. This is not my expected results. That's not my expected results. What is my expected results? Simply, simply, okay. <clears throat> Sorry, T1, wait. This is employee ID, department ID, and max salary from T1. T1 join T2 
on department ID. Okay. Now please execute. We shall equal to oh one minute. I recommend use. My recommendation it is. I mean, even this max I'll try also. This is a temporarily for which it is, even if you mention it, non mention does not matter. Now, 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 what is my requirement right now? What is my requirement? Where shall equal to equal to max cell. Otherwise, max cell is a column name, so no need this one. Now try. Of course, this is one way call temporary table in SQL queries you are doing like this okay let me check hmm, now please check who is the highest secondary salary holder here okay hmm Oh, sorry. Here I mentioned EMP. There is a reason. I'm getting wrong results. Okay. Now you will get exactly expected results. Okay. Now let's try. Hmm. This is one way. In case I don't want SQL queries. Let me try. I'm getting expected results. Yes, this is my expected results. Uh, what is my expected? Department ID, salary, EMP ID. Okay. Department EMP ID, sal max salary you are looking for. If you don't want this, drop this max cell automatically you will get expected results. That's why what are you doing simply? max salary at the time you are dropping this column automatically you get expected results this is sql friendly i don't want this yes in the form of sql i want to do it a programming manner at the time what happened okay using data frame api wait let me check am i getting proper results yes so this is my expected results. Let me check. Okay. Okay. Maybe if you are get, if you want to descending order, do it. To be frankly, same thing you can do it with this functions also. That's not too difficult. That's not too difficult. Windows functions, same thing, hundred percentage. Let me explain this using Windows functions. Okay. Now. How to do it in Windows function? Simple in data frame API, not a Spark SQL. Windows period is equal to partition by uh, department ID. Uh, ordered by I recommend use okay you are using Windows functions rank is equal to what happened uh, 
I think we are using first. First, maybe we are looking for first followed by that means first also one uh, this one uh, analytical function in Windows analytical function. Okay. Sir. Uh, okay. First, I recommend cell followed by ascending order. I think. Okay. What is this? Ignore null symbol. That's not a matter. Okay. Like that, you you are using followed by. Mm, now let me check. Now first, first means what happened along with these columns, you will get. Let me check. You will get first value. What is the highest cell? Like that. Hmm. So this is this. You got it. First value. You got it. Now, where call okay? If you enter like this, you will get who is the highest second, 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 sorry, second holder. Right? That time, drop this. Drop this rank. Okay. Now, what are the columns you don't want? Just to mention this. Maybe you are looking data of joining. Call not required. Okay. Data of joining. Why it is above suggested calls always use string. That's why data of joining and rank also not required. Data of joining also not required. Mm. You should drop. You will get this. By D. Otherwise, same thing you can do it as SQL queries also. Okay. Windows functions also we can do it same. I think this is expected results. Uh, okay. 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 Yes. In that way, based on your business requirement, you can do it in different different ways. Okay, I'm sharing this code on this sample data set also. It is available in this YouTube description. Just to try our level best to do it. Okay, fine. That's it today class. If you have any doubts, comment below. I will try my level best to answer. For more different different uh, interview tips and big data, just follow my YouTube channel. Thank you.